now we will auto scale our database so this is the yml of mongodb auto scaler <coughs> here we are providing the database references our database we will storage auto scale the database so here we are providing the replica set <coughs> in the replica section uh, trigger is on that means in the database will be auto scale you can turn this off to turn off the auto scaling and we are providing the usage threshold as 70 percent scaling threshold as 50 percent that means if the usage of the database stores that means the pvc exceeds 70 percent then it will scale in the database to 50 percent of the current amount so our current amount is uh, 2 gb so it will uh, increase 50 percent so it will increase 1 gb so our database size will be 3 gb if the database uh, storage uh, uses uh, increases to 70 percent so let's uh, watch the mongodb auto scanner Uh, let's apply the auto scaler. So the auto scaler is created. So now we'll exec in the bash and uh, run a command to, to create a file. So our store is full because if we want to insert data and make it uh, to 70 percent it will take some time so we are manually uh, storing uh, data in the so we are storing data in the uh, database path a uh, big file so it will be exit 70 percent so we can see the storage auto scaling here let's start file let's check so our users of the database path uh, this path exceeded 70 percent is now 82 percent let's see if our auto scaler creates an ops request so our database uh, size increases to new size like 3 gb
as you can see a volume expansion object is just created it's now in progressing state you can check the yml of it As you can see, it's set to 3 GB. Also, if you see here, the owner of this uh, object is this nobody brought a scalar. So it is created by the MongoDB Autoscaler. So the obstacles is successful. Also, you can see that the capacity is increased to 3 GB. Let's check it inside from the database. So as you can see, the size is 3 GB. So that database is successfully auto-scaled.